Hey guys, tired of those bat wings? Let's do something about it. Hey guys, it's your girl Shalom. P-R-O-M-O-S-T-K. Eating good in a neighborhood. Promo SDK Reality TV. Oh yeah. Now, I'm going, y'all saw from the, from the title, I'm gonna be working on arms. Mainly this excess skin right here that we, as we get older, we get, right? Now, my, I have some very strong arms, so I need to also tone my arms. And I'm gonna show y'all 10 minutes worth of exercise just on your arms. And you see I'm sitting down, right? You can do this sitting down in your chair and not even break a sweat. That's the good thing about doing arm exercise. You can actually isolate, these exercises can be actually isolated for just your arms. And I know it, as, as women, we have problems with the bat wings and we don't wanna fly with our arms, okay? So I'm gonna take, and before I do anything with my arms, I want to measure. the largest portion of my arm. Okay. And these are things that I learned when I was on a, a physical fitness team back in high school. You know, you know how you learn stuff and you know the stuff you're supposed to do, but as you get older, you just, you just don't do it. Okay, so my arm at the largest, at the largest part is 14 inches, okay? Let's make sure that both of them are the same. Yes, 14 inches. So that's what we're starting at. We want to tone our arms so that the 14 inches gets tightened and you don't see this right here if i if, see this right here some of you guys have it worse than me some of you guys have them already toned this is a way to make them maybe keep them toned but this is what we are going to be working on and you need these and if you don't have them you need these so let's go <laughs> if you don't these are two pound weights if you don't have two pound weights guess what no excuses. Get you some cans. Get you some cans. This is 21 ounces, so it's one pound and a half. One pound, five ounces, so this is one pound and a half each. Or you can you can have, use these restraints right here. And with these, all you do is you put your foot on the bottom of them and spread your feet out as wide as you can to give you more restraint on your arm so you can use these if you don't have these again don't worry about it because you can use your canned goods or you can use your little hand bells right here so let's get started and as i say 10 minutes i have my timer set for 10 minutes and we're gonna start doing the arm circles hold on just a second i had it set all right 10 minutes Okay, and let's get into your arms. So, if you, and if you don't have any weights or any canned goods or anything at all, nothing wrong with your old fashioned arms right here. So we're gonna, we're gonna do it with our weights. These are two pound weights. And for your beginners or starters, don't have to use weights at all. Now we're gonna do as many arm circles forward as you can. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 
40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100. Now, y'all can see I did 100 forward, but I'm used to doing my arm circles. But for you out there, if this is your first time, baby steps. There's nothing wrong with baby steps. Start with 10, start with 20. Do as many as you can at one time. And once you, your arms get tired and you can't do any more, rest because you can always do another thing with your arms. So when I say rest, just put your arms here. Just relax your shoulders, take your shoulders, roll your shoulders backwards. Take deep breaths. Roll them forward. Take deep breaths. And when you're ready to do the next set, again, it doesn't have to be 100. It could be whatever you can do. Put your arms back out. And you want to make sure your arms are parallel to your body. You don't want to, you don't want to do arm circles like this or like this or like this. You want to do your arm circles with your arms outstretched. Now we're going backwards. Do as many as you can. One, two, three, four, five, six. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 6, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 77, 8, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100. All right, put your hands down and rest. Roll your shoulders backwards. Woo, breathe. Make sure you breathe in and out. Roll them forward. All right, now what you're going to take with your arm, you're going to do your arm curls. So hold your arm out like this. Like you're trying to give somebody something like here, take it, take it. Hold that like this, and we're gonna do arm curls. It's going and all we're gonna do is roll our arm up like this. Hold back down. New. We're gonna do 20 of those. That's two. One, two, three, come on. Three. Four. Five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. 18, 19, 20. Now rest. Now we're gonna take our other arm, stretch it out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, 
14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Get your last your arm. Now, if I lost you guys at 20, whatever was your comfortable zone, however many you did, make it your set and then build up on that, okay? So don't get discouraged if you don't think you can do five or you can, can't do 10 because it all starts with baby steps, okay? So we've done those. Now we're gonna take and we're gonna hold our arms up like this, okay? And we're gonna curl up. Will you, you can do alternate with your left or your right. This time around, I'm gonna do them at the same time. And again, 20. But do what, however many you can do in your set. <clears throat> One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. breath and bring them down. Now roll your shoulders backwards. Rotate your neck. Be sure to continue to breathe. Now roll your shoulders forward. Just kind of relax as you get all the extra tension. We have about a minute and 45 seconds left. So what we'll do with the last is we'll do this. Put your fists together like this and then outstretch like this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Bring it down, breathe. Again, rotate your shoulders backwards. And rotate your shoulders forward. That's the end of our 10 minutes, you guys. You'll hear the alarm going off shortly. But remember, do these arm exercises in your own time, 10 minutes a day for 30 days. Be sure to measure your arm to make sure you see a difference. And again, you don't have to stop at 10 minutes. If you feel you can go longer, go longer. We're targeting the arms. We're targeting this area right here. That's the area. That was our 10 minutes. I hope you guys enjoy those exercises. Hit me up in the comment section below if you would like to see any other arm exercises. Again, those are some that will trigger that wound being reduced. Because if you're on a weight loss journey and you're losing fat, what happens when you lose fat? You have that excess skin. So go ahead now and start tightening up that skin along with your muscles so that you're losing them at the same time. And if you're not on a weight loss journey and you just wanna to tone your arms, do these exercises. I guarantee you will see results. Until the next video, we're, gonna, we're on day one. We're gonna do 30 days of 10 minutes 
and we're at the end of that 30 day, we're gonna measure and we're gonna see where my arms are. We're gonna see where your arms are. Bye.